What's up, guys? Back at it again. Now, I just wanted to shoot this video right quick. Uh, I'm down here at the at the beachfront, uh, doing a little more uh, adjusting the the gains on the mids and highs amp. Uh, I was something just wasn't sounding right, so I reached out to um, some of the bass heads that I met on Facebook. That's uh, over on the other side of Virginia, where I live at. And, uh, a uh, guy was uh, Brandon. This dude's name was nice enough to do a video, a video uh, chat with me through Facebook Messenger to kind of help me adjust adjust the uh, mids and highs amp. Come to find out, dude, there's no way that the shop did any tuning to to the to that amp. They did very little. They did. I guess they did all right on this one. We had to turn the we turned the um, the subsonic down to because I think they had it at like close to like 28 hertz maybe so we cut that down to you know around 20 and I was wondering why the the, the lower uh, the lower end wasn't really picking up as good because I mean like 20 29 hertz ports tuned to 32 but it still should play below that um so we cut that back and uh, uh it's, it's an amazing difference like i said shout out to him for spending over an hour to kind of help me help me tune my my mids and highs amp pretty much got it to the best that it's going to get right now the highs are definitely louder and not as um not as scratchy sounding when you turn it up it was just sounded horrible um and i don't want it to sound like shit to be honest with you i didn't do this build for it to sound like shit so yeah so there's a dude uh dude come up to me and asked me if i could uh if i mind turning that that bass down on that that audio system you got there in your in your truck and i was like sure why not so um yeah he he said that i was shaking this whole house and uh that's his he come from over that house right there so I that's the rear of the that's the rear of it I can imagine what it sounds like in front uh, so you know I you know you know I didn't get stupid man there's no need to get stupid so you know I told him you know I was just doing a little tuning and you know that I, that I'm I'm done you know he's like well I appreciate that so yeah I got a show coming up got a show coming up this saturday this saturday can't wait dude It'll be the first time i've ever gone to a show It'll be the first time i get to put this thing on the meter it's a mecca um it's a mecca show they'll be there uh doing the competition side of the whole car show deal uh definitely be shooting videos so be sure to um look for those coming up after the weekend uh pretty much it starts at one and don't get over until 10 uh they don't give out the awards for the base competition until 9 30 so pretty much i'm gonna have to stay unless i just feel like i've just done crappy but you know I'm, i don't think so so anyway so just thought i'd give you a little update i'll holler at you later Thank you.
I said I got a car show and a competition to go to. I'm just to get a meter. I'm thinking 140s. Voltage dropping below 10 volts. There you go. 24 6? 24 7. Yeah. Okay. It, it likes around 39. I think it peaks around 39. Place that I can really put it. Her. So, what's pushing that? Uh, 3,500 watt twisted sound. Damn. Yeah. Damn that yeah. I thought it was you parked in a parking store while I was doing my power acoustic. <laughs> 